Sí. Six, seven, eight. Morning. Morning. Um, how much is this? Three pounds. Ah. Is there something wrong with your head? Are you wagging it to say no? There's nothing wrong with my head, or is it just uncontrollable? Perhaps you'd like me to put the price down. Well, I was thinking two pounds. Because three pounds is just naked profiteering for a book <laughs> mere 912 pages long. What'll I do with that extra pound? I'll add an acre to the grounds. I'll chuck some more koi carp in my piano-shaped pond. <laughs> no, I know. I'll build a wing on the National Gallery with my name on it. 250. <laughs> That's more like it. Hmm. Now you're being reasonable. 250 gets you this much. You can have the rest, and you come back with the other 50 p. Could you? Thank you. You know, if the two of you could do something relaxing together, this place wouldn't be so tense. What? Every time we bicker, we should have sex. Let's have a drink and be yourself again, will you? So what's it like, then? You know, fags and booze. Well, to be honest, after years of smoking and drinking, you do sometimes look at yourself and think. Yep. You know, just sometimes in between the first cigarette with coffee in the morning to that 400th glass of corner shop piss at 3 a.m. <laughs> you do sometimes look at yourself and think. Yep. This is fantastic. <laughs> I'm in heaven. It's Sunday, right? Yes. And we want to get away from the house. Yes. Why don't we go to the park? <laughs> Do you think that suggestion really deserved the preface, hey, hey, hey? <laughs> what about the cinema? <clears throat> Let's see. OK, how about this? Buffont. Sandra Bullock plays a woman who sets up a tiny hairdresser's in the trenches of the First World War. No. <laughs> Here we go, here we go. Regression. Richard Gere. Bloke has to kill himself to go back into the past to rescue himself as a child. So he can grow up to kill himself to go back into the past to rescue himself as a child. So he can grow up... No! Come on, must be something else. What's this? Blue Tunes. Math Damon, Ben Affleck, Mini Driver. Oh, I hate her. Grouchy <laughs> Leonard Blue runs a second-hand record shop with his half-wit mustachioed assistant, Danny. <laughs> When this zany pair team up with bitchy, neurotic neighbour Pam, things are sure to be a riot of laughs. Where did they get this crap? Van! Hello. How's it going? Might be a slight rent increase soon. Uh, price of light bulbs. <laughs> What's this, 2B? There was never a 2B. This is a new door. You have moved my bloody wall and put a room in. <laughs> you funny, Fran. <laughs> it's a Victorian house. A lot of them were built with redouble perspective. <laughs> so you might think a room's twice as big or small as it actually is. <laughs> there was never a flat here. It's the heat, love. Playing tricks with your mind. No, no Dawn, that's rude, love. Hello. Oh, hi. Are you in 2A? I'm in 2. There is no 2A. Oh, come on. This flat's always been here. Remember the Bracewells? And the Guptas before that? 
little son here with his trumpet practice. Mr Marchman, I meant to ask you, when are you going to fix the peephole? I can see into the flat from out here, but I can't see out from in there. It's weird. Soon, love, soon. Don't listen to him. He's making this all up. This is a new room. She's a bit. I am not a bit. Would you like to come in for a coffee and we can talk about this? Oh, coffee. Yeah, yeah. Coffee that I've spilt on the carpet, you've picked up with tweezers, put in the jar, and now you're going to serve it right back to me. <laughs> OK, that was mad. But everything I said before that was true. I want my flat back! Girls! 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 You're both such lovely girls. You'll be sure to sugar in no time. Don't fight. And if you do, fight nice. With pillars and... Jim Chums. <laughs> Beautician on a cruise liner? Too booty. <laughs> you can find work and sort your life out any time. The pub closes in five hours. <laughs> you could try and help. It's not easy finding a job. Have manies. He knows he's useless. He won't mind. You work here and he can go back to whatever seaman shelter he was born in. <laughs> Enough. The pub. Come on, Manny. No, I won't bother. I'm useless, apparently. I'll just stay here. Oh, don't take it like that. I only meant in the sense you never do anything of any use. <laughs> I hope you've got some keys for when you roll in drunk. I'm off to bed. <sighs> Manny, I've left my keys somewhere. Bring them over, will you? <laughs> yes. Oh, hello, Gus. Long time no speaky. Oh, when did you get out? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What, your nephew? Yeah. I'm sure we could do a book reading, yeah. No problem. Yeah. Yeah, listen, Gus. A friend of mine's looking for work. Uh, you wouldn't have to know of anything, would you? Yeah. Right. Great, yeah. What's the name? OK, hang on. Now we'll see who's useless. All right, far away. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah. No. No. Yeah. Oh, how many times have I? How many times have I heard that? Just get it sorted, right? Frank. Right. Yeah. Look, we're not living on a farm, right? Do you take my point? So just do it, because it is your job! Vouchers for the canteen. I'm, I'm sorry about this. Yeah. No. <laughs> no. No! <laughs> it's the front. I'll show you a disc. Oh, great. Mm. Uh, right. Go on, go on. S sorry, uh, I, I don't actually no. know what the job... What I'm... Oh, for Christ's sake! Does he have to be told everything? I'll see you later. <laughs> Enough! Enough today. Lots of work to be done. Stupid piano. You will practice all evening. Swear to me. I swear. <laughs> I will be back tomorrow and every day until you can play. Weekend off. That girl, I mean Kate, she asked me out. Couldn't resist my musk. <laughs> What's the matter? Oh, it's so unfair. I must be musical. I've got hundreds of CDs. <laughs> he wants me to practice all evening like a child. He's such a meanie. <laughs> I always wanted to learn, but my parents forced me not to. <laughs> I spent hour after hour playing football, all by myself. <laughs> peering in at all the other children in the neighbourhood, practising their piano. Bigfoot, get on with us. You're not off till tomorrow. Well, what are you going to do with all your time off, Manny? Oh, I don't know. Long baths, braid my beard, unbraid it. <laughs> Lie around fondling moonbeams, being a lord of leisure. Go on, you. Get cracking. OK. <clears throat> Got to get down to this. <laughs> No, where, where are you going? Drink. 